Senator Wu. Senator Gold, what is the government doing to assess if there have been violations of international humanitarian law in the ongoing conflict between Hamas and Israel, including the possibility of war crimes? Senator Gold. <clears throat> The government remains very, very concerned uh, with the circumstances unfolding uh, in that area in Gaza. Uh, it remains uh, in regular contact with our democratic allies, which include Israel, uh, Five Eyes and others. Uh, as the government has made it clear, it is also uh, supports uh, international processes to ensure that human humanitarian law is respected by all parties to the conflict, and it will continue to do so. Another rule. Senator Gagol, the conflict is ongoing, and there are many credible allegations of uh, violations of international humanitarian law. I would expect that the government would be doing its own analysis. Will the government make that analysis available to Canadians? And will it also consider employing its full gamut of autonomous sanctions against violations? Senator Gold. <clears throat> there are indeed our allegations. Uh, I'm not in a position, and nor is the government at this juncture, at, uh, to assess the credibility of those allegations. But again, the government will continue to, uh, and is continuing to monitor uh, the situation carefully, and will take all appropriate measures for this government in the context of this very tragic uh, and unfolding situation.